In our last example of the demonstration, we will create a pie chart of treatment outcomes during 2020 for the whole of training land. To get started on the third example, we first need to open a new visualization. Then we need to select the chart type. In this example, we want to choose the pie chart. In the data tab, we will again select the program and program stage, malaria case management. Then choose the data element, treatment outcome. Using the fixed and relative periods option, choose the yearly period of 2020 and untick the last 12 months. Select Training Land as the primary organization unit of analysis. The layout will need to be updated too. Period should be filtered. Organization unit should act as the series dimension. And the treatment outcome as the category dimension. For pie charts, just like in the data visualizer apps, the category defines the slices of the pie. Upon clicking update, the pie chart will appear to show a high level overview of the breakdown of treatment outcomes for malaria cases in training land. This is taken from the option set that is applied to this particular data element. Make sure to save the table as a favorite by clicking on Favorites and then Save. When saving the report, you can provide the favorite with a name which includes your initials and a description if required. That concludes the subsection on the Event Visualizer application. We hope you found this demonstration useful. Let's just highlight what we learned in this subsection. We described the Event Visualizer interface. We now understand how to create visualizations using event data. We are able to use the Event Visualizer to apply option sets and value ranges to visualizations. We illustrated how to modify the layout in event visualizations. And we explained how to modify the options of these visualizations. We hope you have been following along with the step-by-step -step activities listed under the videos. But if you haven't, please refer to them for extra practice to help ensure the understanding of the information presented on the Event Visualizer app. Also, use the discussion forum to ask questions to other learners or facilitators. Once you have completed the activities and are comfortable with the material, please attempt the graded assignment for this subsection.